All right, now that we've got the top tier and the bottom tier put together, we need to attach the center panel of the shade. This is the center panel for the shade that I'm building right now. Um, you want to, again, place it face down on the edge of the table. Then you want to start with the top ring, find the seam. You want the seam lined up at the very edge of the material. So line it up at the edge of the material, roll it forward until the first support on the combo ring is straight down, and then set it down with that support in between the two closest holes that it's closest to. Then you're going to grab your lacing, just like you did before. Put your piece of tape on, six to eight inches from the end. And then, because this is a little bit larger diameter tier, you're gonna start about five holes from the end instead of just two. And then up through the bottom. Around the ring. Oh, dropped it, that happens. And again, on this one, you're going to get to a point where the holes just seem too far away to wrap the lace around the frame. At this point, you're going to pick up the whole thing, pinch it, hopefully you can see this in the video, but pinch it between your thumb and the, the ring and have everything kind of in one hand. And then you just keep going around up through the bottom, around the ring and back down. And remember, you only have to go about three quarters of the way around and then the shade will kind of stand up by itself and you can work it from there. So then you can stand it up, start pulling the slack out. And again, I'm just lightly taking the slack out. I'm not pulling it super tight yet. the panel overlaps itself a little bit. So you want to overlap those and make sure that this lace goes through both panels. And at this point, when it's still loose, you have, this is your opportunity to kind of align the seams a little bit if they've gotten off. So just kind of make sure that the seams are lined up before you go through one more time. Make sure your tape's tight and take all the slack out, just like you did on the other two tiers. When you get to the end, pull the tape. Uh, your triple knot. Now on this one, your first over and under is really easy. Then it's it's easier for me to kind of reach underneath to do the second one because you can get your left hand closer to the knot. And the same for your third. Cut the tails, and that part's done.